We tried to be grossed out with this video because you clicked it because you wanted to see it because I already labeled the title what it's going to be. So with that being said, I'm going to show you guys how I eat my ham hocks. Now I cooked it with the beans, the northern beans. If you guys watch my Save A Lot grocery haul, you would have seen it there. And I also added a can of collard greens to them, to the beans. And then I added a can of soup, which is... Uh, I think I added a uh, mushroom soup. Then I put it in a crock pot and I let it cook for a long time until it is soft. See how how soft that became. Now I'm not going to eat the whole piece. I'm just going to eat some of it and show you guys. So once it gets soft, and this is not something that you eat all the time. This is just like you know every now and again you eat it because it's real hearty and. I just get a knife and then I take out that part and you can also use fork or what have you but I'm just using a spoon and knife for now for the video and then I added some rice on top of it you could put whatever you could use black rice brown rice parboiled rice um, jasmine rice, basmati, whatever kind of rice you guys prefer. You can even use quinoa. You can use um, barley, whatever. I'm just showing you guys. And, you know, I've been eating this for a very long time. And I don't eat it all the time. But, yeah, it's awesome. So here is what it looks like. And that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And maybe you want to try this meal one day because it is thumbs up. Just don't eat it all the time because, you know, kind of salty and things like that. But if you rinse it with water, clean it out before you cook it in your crock pot, then you should be, you know, good to go it's just the preservatives and the way they preserve the things in these that's what makes it kind of you know salty so yeah that's it you guys thank you so much for watching please don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys on the next video